I promise we are going to find the perfect house and live the life of our dreams. I'm going to recommend you speak to a friend of mine. If there's anybody who can help you, it's Emmett Claymore. Hey, honey, I got a great idea. Let's go visit the dude with the big scary house out in the middle of nowhere. What could possibly go wrong? So glad you decided to come. John. John. This is my wife, Sarah. Lovely to meet you. It's really perfect. What if this house were yours? Sorry, I don't follow. Let's forget the financial facts for a moment, and just for the sake of argument, can a house make you happy? Ooh, ooh. Dear John and Sarah, it's clear you seek a new beginning, and I'd like to help. This house represents a past I wish to leave behind. I'd like to give the house to you, with one simple condition. You must never open the cellar door. He's giving us this house for free. It doesn't make any sense. But this is what we've always wanted. We can be really happy here. <laughs> this place is incredible. Oh, thank you. you. Ever find out what was in the cellar? Life is good. I don't need to look. I think you want to look. I think you can't help yourself. You must be the new neighbor. I hope you guys stick around. One of the first people he's done this to. We could lose everything. Do you really want that? 25 years ago, Emma Claymore's wife and daughter just disappeared. This is my life we always dreamed of. All for the low, low cost of your soul. There's something in this house. We can't stay here. We gotta get out. The house. It has its secrets. Ever since we moved into the house, everything has gone to shit. I'm trying to protect you. Looking into a missing persons report? All you had to do was just stay away. No, John! Enough! You know what they say about old houses? They all have their deep, dark secrets.